from behind. Talk about that factor. I mean, you weren't used to being down 13 with 14 minutes left. Um, you know, it's a different environment when you know you're down 13. But uh, we kept fighting and we cut it short. We just didn't come up with a W. How frustrating is it to play personally well but then have a loss? Um, it's frustrating. You know, I just, I just wish we could have won. But you know, you win some, you lose some. But you know, we just gotta keep fighting. It seemed like you had a lot of shots that were very close to going in, but kind of rolling around the rim. Um, you know, it's the way the ball goes. You just feel like some nights it does that versus... Yeah, I mean, some nights you make them all, some nights you might miss some, some nights you miss them all. Thank you. What's the main takeaway? I mean, you know, obviously a tough game. Like, what do y'all learn from it as far as... We just got to be more disciplined on defense, and we can't come out at the beginning of the game lethargic. And we just got to, uh, we just got to fight. I know former players have said that it's hard to have like early play, early games. Like, do you think that has like a factor since it was scores early? Um, I think it should, but you know, some guys, you know, they get mentally prepared differently from others. So I mean, some people probably won't mentally prepared, but that's something that costs us again. Do you do anything to mentally prepare yourself? Um, you know, I just try to focus. You know, I just sit in the room, uh, just think about how the game's gonna go and just get prepared. I asked Malik, uh, you know, is there any learning process of you know, who's gonna take over a game late maybe for, for you guys? You know, you've all been in high school, you were the main guys, you took over your games. Is there a question of, is that a learning process of like who's gonna step up maybe? I mean, you never know, cause you know, one night, you know, you might have a, we all we, we might have different leading scores, so you never know how the uh, the game is going. You know, some some player uh, could be hot, and you just keep feeding the ball. Some some others might come up late and just make a good shot. Man, what did you think you guys learned from this? Um, we gotta be more disciplined on defense, and you know we can't come out at the end of the game with Georgia. Coach didn't want to make excuses about guys being sick, but do you think that had a factor? Derek was saying he's been up all night. Other guys have been sick. Um, you know, Michael Jordan played with the flu, and you know that's that's way different from a cold. You know, you can fight through a cold, but I don't think it had nothing to do with the game. You know, we just didn't make shots, and some people who didn't take shots they should have took. Bam, sometimes it's hard to, to learn valuable lessons when you guys are winning by 30, you know, 40 against Arizona State. Is it easier to learn after something like this? Uh, yeah, because you start to uh, pay more attention to detail. And, you know, you just focus more on what your job is and what you're supposed to do. Did they surprise you at all with uh, what they had inside? They had a lot of length and you guys that were giving you some trouble? No, I mean... They're just like another person does, you know. It's another basketball game, and it's time to move on to the next one. You all are ranked number one, and probably after this, you know, you may go down in the polls. Do you think sometimes it's good not to be ranked number one? Um, you know, either way, we're always going to have a target on our black. I mean, we're the University of Kentucky. That's just how it's going to be all year. Man, I'm sure you've been asked about this, but uh, you had a double double. There was you know, several times though, uh, it was right around the basket, couldn't finish. Cal City one, you just dunk some of those. What, what, do you, what do you attribute to, I guess, to some of the struggle? Um, you know, just got to make shots. I mean, there's no other way to say it. He seemed to suggest to us he wants you dunking rather than shooting. I mean, whatever makes the ball go in. Two more guys. You think this will ultimately be a good thing today? What happened to you guys? Yeah, you know, it's a learning experience for us, and uh, we learn from it.